Over 4.5 billion years ago, planets formed in our solar system. How this happened remains a mystery to scientists. A team of students in Germany is the latest to tackle this question, designing an experiment to be performed on the International Space Station. Understanding the solar system or its origins is simply fascinating because there is a, a huge effort in understanding how planets are formed. We still have a problem in deciding which of the few theories are correct. And one of them is the nebular lightning theory. And we think that this plays a significant role in the early stages of planetary formation. The German Aerospace Center sponsored a contest for student teams to send an experiment to the ISS. Among the winners is a team from Goethe University Frankfurt to test the lightning theory. AXIS is an acronym for experimental control formation aboard the ISS. Chondroids are these small objects then that can be found in many meteorites. And it's believed that these chondroids are the building blocks of our solar system. The nebula lightning theory is one of the three main theories which could have formed the chondroids, but it has never been tested. The main reason why this project has to be conducted on the ISS is because we need microgravity to float our dust. We have built a box 10 by 10 by 15 centimeters, which will be flown to the International Space Station. There's an electric discharge mechanism in this little box. And of course, in the microgravity aboard the International Space Station, the dust will float. And then the dust will be subjected to electric arcs. This will be observed via video camera and the video will be then streamed back to us here. Then we will just have two sets of sample where we can compare on how microgravity influences the formation of these little particles, the chondrules. As we were choosing to have our experiment on board the ISF with our students, we were really happy about this because it's, it's very uncommon to have an experiment at the ISS and it will be a, a really scientifically high project. For years people wanted to have this experiment on board of the ISS and now we are the first to have the option to do, really do this experiment. Uh, we're quite sure we will learn a lot of the information of, of solids in our solar system.